What's up guys, Abdullah Media, Luna Studios and in today's tutorial I'm going to teach you how to create this effect. So here we are in After Effects, just create a new comp like this. Now go to the select the pen tool and just draw a rough uh, glass. I'm going to just do something like this. Change the color to white. I'm holding Alt so it can affect the uh, one hand only. Now go grab this thing. Give it a shape of a glass as you know better than me what glass looks like. Here is uh, the top of the glass. Now just create a simple. Line, straight line. Go to the shape layer, shape two. Go to the stroke of shape two. Increase the stroke like this. Now after that, you can create a bottom for it. So the bottom is pretty much. So here is our glass, simple glass, you can create a better one than this. So let's just duplicate, we're gonna call it glass, duplicate it, we're gonna call it glass reflection. Just create a new solid, a background solid, whatever you think looks good. glass and turn down its opacity so just go to reflection delete the shape 3 and shape 2 we don't need it we just need the top of it and just and just play with the This one here and we have this over here. Here we are with the reflection, just turn down the opacity for the reflection layer 2. So here is a simple reflection. Now we're gonna create the filling effect. To create that effect, just go to layer new solid and select whatever color you want this one is orange and just create a rough mask over this solid Make a keyframe for the position, go 12 frames ahead, 12, 13, or whatever you think looks good, and pull it up like this. Easy, ease them. Now, all you're gonna need now is the mat, just duplicate the glass, glass tool again, and name it the mat. Go to contents and delete. Shape 3 and shape 2. Here we are. Yes. Put that above. Turn the opacity to 100% and scale it down a bit. Here we are. Let's see matte. Now change the liquid layer track matte to alpha matte. So here we are. It's almost done look how cool it looks so just give 
some waves to the liquid layer so it's not gonna stay still and just give it a curve Select the liquid layer, go to effect, distort, wave warp, it's right here, wave warp effect, so you can see, so change it to 6, change this one width to 20, I think, this to play with it, change the direction to Speed remains the same and everything other remains the same. So just go in here, keyframe the wave height, go to the end, turn it to 0.2, go a bit further and change it to 0. So here are our keyframes. direction if you want and change the speed if you need so now we're gonna create that effect which is gonna fill the glass so we're gonna create a source for the glass to get filled by Create it just to go and without selecting anything, make a rough mask like this. Control, I'm holding the control, click here. Contents add trim part. In trim part, just go and make a keyframe for the end. Just go back five frames or six, whatever works good, and change the end to zero person. So that's how it's gonna look like now. And as the glass gets filled up just create a keyframe for the start it's gonna be zero and go one two three four five and change it to hundred percent so that's how it's gonna look you can use easy easing that looks good that's how this effect is done if you like this tutorial please leave a thumb up down below and comment uh, what you think about it and please please subscribe because it helps a lot and thanks for watching